Create beautiful projects like these with just one simple tool. If you remember wood burning as something from summer camp, it might be time to take a second look. This is a great little kit you can pick up at Lowe's. It comes with a good selection of tips to get different effects, and you can use it on a lot of materials. Cork, leather, suede, and of course, wood. Before you jump right in, take the tool for a test run. That way you can kind of get the feel of the tool and the tips. See how your material will react to different pressures, all that good stuff. Here are some basic pointers I picked up trying out the tool. The tool heats up almost immediately, so put your first tip on before you plug it in. Slow and steady wins the race here. It isn't a fast technique, so take your time. Apply even pressure as you go, and the longer you leave your tool in one place, the deeper and darker the burn will be. Burning with the grain will provide the least resistance to the tool. Burning against the grain, more resistance. You can pencil on a design to follow or even transfer a design from graphite or carbon paper. Or if you're comfortable freehanding, go crazy. It's a fun tool to play around with. As you're working along, you may reach a point where you feel the tool isn't burning as well. Try rubbing the tip over a sanding block to get rid of any buildup debris. And while burning into a material seems awfully permanent, if you make a mistake when you're working on wood, you can always sand it out. When you want to change out a tip, remember this tool is hot. So use a pair of pliers and put the tip on a scrap of granite or leftover tile. It's also a good resting surface for the tool and the tips while you work. So get inspired by our ideas or come up with your own and have fun trying out this tool.